How you guys doing? Uh, I'm Game Guy, and uh, I know I haven't made a video in a while, but what you gonna do about it? So today I am going to be reviewing and unboxing the Beats by Dr. Dre. I bought these probably two weeks ago, and now uh, they're they're pretty good quality headphones, but there are um, downsides and upsides to them. So uh, let's get on with the video. <clears throat> so the Beats that I have are the uh, tour edition. They're the in-ear earbud ones. Um, these cost about two hundred dollars, I think. That's two hundred Canadian dollars, and um, um, the box is really cool. You know, it's uh, on the back. It's got Dr. Dre and all his writing. Nothing really that interesting. Just kind of trying to sound cool, but you know. So uh, unbox it, and it's in this little kind of box. You know, it's a little pull tab. And it's set up like that inside. Uh, this is actually the carrying case for your headphones, which is really neat. It's actually pretty sturdy, so I wouldn't. I'd feel comfortable uh, wrapping up the headphones, tossing here and tossing in my bag, and just running out. I'd be perfectly happy. This is a really strong, sturdy bag. Um, inside of the bag, there's a little baggie, and inside there are five sets of headphones, maybe four sets, five in total. When one's already on there. So four in here, and you can change the headphone, like the little plastic thing on the end, to uh, to your uh, specifications, depending on which one fits the nicest. And as to the actual headphones, let's take them out of the box here. These are the headphones. You know, you got that B, so when you got them in the area, people will know that you're wearing Beats. Uh, and these are the standard little pieces that it comes with on the end. I didn't like these personally. I like the, uh, but there's four to choose from. I like the, uh, let me show you. I like these cone ones personally. So I just, when I use them, I take these off and put these on because I like these ones better. But, um, the headphones are pretty nice. They uh, they come with this flat wire, you know. Contrary to these are this type of wire. It's flat. It's and it's a lot thicker. And apparently that's to uh, cut back on tangle. And uh, it works pretty much. Uh, so I just whenever I pack them up, I just put them around my finger, put them in the case, and then toss them away in the in the, in my cupboard or wherever and sometimes even when I don't put them in the case they still they still don't tangle so it works pretty well as for sound quality I've been listening to a lot of different kinds of music with these um, Linkin Park to Eminem to anything to jazz just I, I don't really listen to jazz I just did it to test it out and the sound quality is uh, really good except the one issue that I did have with these was uh, they do leak sound. Um, it's not horrific. It's not like super super bad. But um, if you're if you're like 75% people around you will be 75% volume. People will around around you will be able to hear what you're listening to um, fairly clearly. And uh, it can be irritating to them. But if you really don't care about them, I, you know that's not the hugest issue to me. Uh, you know. But if you don't like that, then try and look for other headphones because they these headphones do leak. Um, another issue I had was they block sound from outside way too well. If I have these in my ear, I can't hear anything that anyone is talking to me about. So I had these in my ear and my brother walks into my room and starts talking to me and he's literally talking for about five minutes and I just let him talk to uh, test out what, how these were at canceling sound. Even with the music paused, it was what I still couldn't hear half of what he's saying. He was completely muffled and the sound blocking on these is crazy except it's too much for me um i like having being able to hear what's going on around me too so you know these aren't the most ideal headphones for that but the sound quality more than makes up for it so um my thoughts overall are if you have two hundred dollars then uh to, to spend on headphones then i would highly recommend these um, they're about fifty dollars cheaper than the over the the big headphone ones. I didn't really want those big headphone ones because you know that's not really my style. I don't like the big headphones. I do have a pair of Steinhausers that are over the ear, but they're good and they're not ridiculously bulky. So um, yeah, overall I'd give these headphones a eight and a half out of ten. 
that I'm going to take half a point off for... I, I don't know, you know, I'll give it a 9.5 out of 10. Because I was going to give half a point off for canceling sound too well, but I was like, oh, that's a little bit stupid for taking points off for that. I'll give it a, a half a point to maybe a point off for the uh, leaking sound. But the sound quality of these are amazing. They definitely resemble uh, the quality of even higher, more expensive ones like the Bose. Uh, they're similar in quality, except the Bose don't leak sound as, as much. And uh, these are good for the, for the money, definitely. Definitely worth the money. Um... So, uh, yeah, that's my review on uh, the Beats by Dre, and um, I hope you enjoyed. I hope it was informative to you, and I hope you're not mad that I haven't made a video in a while. So, uh, yeah, uh, later, guys.